Yo, what's up everybody? It's your boy Floss back again with another video and today we're going to take a look at the Samsung Level U wireless headphones. Now I've been getting a lot of requests to check these out so we're going to check them out and also been getting a lot of requests to compare them versus the Samsung Gear Circle headphones and we'll do that too. First up, let me show you the website real quick so you can see where to get them from. Go to Amazon.com. I'll throw the link up in the description. All right, so we got the Samsung Level U Bluetooth wireless in-ear headphones with microphone. Now, the price for these, 66 bucks, so less than $70. Now, it comes in two colors. You got white and you got black sapphire, which is really uh, blue and black. Pause this and read it for yourself if you want, but let's go through the features real quick. You got 12 millimeter speaker units deliver high quality clear sound. You got dual mic noise reduction and echo cancellation, reduce outside sound. Battery life up to 11 hours talk time and 10 hours of play time. And you also get 500 hours of standby time. Now these feature magnetic earbuds for convenient wear, uh, convenient wear when not in use. And these also work with the Samsung Level app for your uh, Samsung or Android device. All right, so that's basically it now. Less than 70 bucks. Let's take a look. Simple presentation. Nothing fancy at all. This is what they're going to look like when you're wearing them. All right, so I'm not going to give y'all a live demonstration of me wearing them. So get a look. This is how they look. Go right around your ear, uh, right around your neck like that. And these little magnetic buds go into your ears. Okay, let's see any features that we missed from the website. 12 millimeter speaker units, dual uh, mic noise reduction for echo cancellation, magnetic earbuds. All right, flexible urethane joints. Okay, Samsung active air gels. Like I said, these uh, work with the Samsung level app. These also work with our uh, S Voice, so you'll be able to use your S Voice app and the same battery life 500 hours standby, 11 hours talk, 10 hours play. Here's the button placement right here. All right, we'll go through that in a minute. Let's see what you get inside the box. You get the Level U headphones, three sets of air gels, so that's two standard gels, one stabilizing gel. You get a micro USB charging cable, some rubber bands, and a user's manual. Pretty straightforward. We haven't done it in a while, fellas. We haven't done it in a while. Let's activate beast mode. Ah! Okay, okay. <sighs> Needed to do that one time. Fellas, deactivate beast mode. Dramatic effect. All right, so here's your book. Usual books and shit. File that to the side. Now, these are going to be, let's see which ones are the stabilizing. Okay, these are the stabilizing earbuds. Let's pull these out real quick. With the little wings on them. Okay, so you got the stabilizing earbuds and you got some standard size ones. Let's uh, see what the standard ones look like. I'll probably rock with the stabilizer ones. And you got some standard ones. Okay, so let's put them side by side so you can see the difference. Okay, so the wings and non wings. Micro USB charging cable added to your collection. And here's the actual level U headphones. Let's pull these out. Pretty uh pretty basic presentation. Kind of downgrade from your usual Samsung presentations, but it is what it is. Less than 70 bucks. We ain't gonna complain. Okay, let's get this plastic off of here real quick. Got a bunch of plastic on here. <laughs> oh boy, here we go. I might have deactivated the beast mode too early. Okay. On the back, you got some level branding. Now, these are black sapphire. But like I said, they kind of have a bluish, bluish hue to it. Okay, so if you're looking for jet black, these are not going to be them. Here's your rubber joints right here, accent and rubber joints. So this way you could uh, flex these a little bit. If you got a big neck like me, these will fit. Let's see. Let's look at for. <laughs> let's check out all the ports and all that good stuff. Inside, let me zoom in on that. You got an LED light right there. That's your little LED light. Here's your on and off switch. On the top, this is where you're going to plug them in at. Micro USB charging port. And on the right side, here goes all your buttons. Now you got play and pause. Has a nice, nice rubber feel to it, a nice click to it. You got volume up and volume down. And if you long press, you got skip forward or reverse tracks. And that's pretty much it. Pretty straightforward. Okay, now, when they say the rubber bands that it comes with, this is what you're going to need those rubber bands for. I deserve so for your cable management adjustable rubber bands 
that's cool the headset itself let's see, let's see how easy these are clip together magnetically let's see if we can get them to click without touching them okay well it's somewhat click let's see how easy it is to click these though okay there it goes look you don't have to you don't have to aim them or nothing I'm just gonna let them rest on my fingertips all right so that's a strong magnetic clip you got your right and left okay pretty much pretty much straightforward now before I test them out let's talk about the gear circles real quick here's the problem with the gear circles you're gonna have to use this let me zoom out a little bit you're gonna have to use this plastic neck guard now you don't have to if you want you can take the plastic neck guard off. Let me, let, me, let me pop it off real quick so I can show you. You can take the plastic neck guard off and rock them just like this if you want. But without the plastic neck guard, if you start doing any physical activity, if you start doing too much moving around, even um, power walking, you don't even have to be walking, uh, you don't have to be running. Even if you're walking fast and you're doing stuff, they're going to start flip-flopping. So say you got them around your neck like this, without the neck guard, once you start doing stuff, especially if you go to the gym. If you go to the gym without the neck guard on, as soon as you start doing some exercises, they're going to start going like this. Okay, now once they're in your ear, that's one thing. But if, you, if you're not listening to them, if you just have them on, they're going to start flip-flopping all over the place. So you're going to need this neck guard. Now the problem with the neck guard is this. When you buy the Samsung Circles, you're going to get three neck guards. You're going to get small, medium, and large. Right? Now I got a big neck, ladies. <laughs> Oh, all jokes aside though, I got a big neck, so I went with the uh, size large, the size large neck guard. And I'm, you know, I'm kind of heavy handed, I'll be up in the gym, you know, doing all kind of crazy exercises. And I went to take these off, and I took them off too fast, and I broke the plastic neck guard. Okay, now without the plastic neck guard, these are not going to stay in place. So now I had to switch to the medium. So it comes with small, medium, and large. Now with the medium ones, I can still use them, I can still rock them, but they're just pressing against my neck. So after about an hour, I got to take these off, cutting off circulation to the head. You know what I'm saying? So the plastic neck guard is important for these. So if you buy the gear circles, you better keep that neck guard and, and be mindful of how it's very easy to break too. Not too much flexion on these. And the second problem with the gear circle is when you're wearing these around your neck, the earbuds are going to be pressing against your chest. So it's going to make these poke, poke out a little bit. So it's not resting flat against your shirt. Or your chest, if you know, if you don't got no shirt on or whatever, whatever you're doing, it's gonna poke out. It's gonna stick out a little bit. So that's the two things about the gear circles I don't like. Now, as far as the sound wise, these sound great. These sound great. That's why I still have them. That's why I still use them. So, with that being said, let's actually let's let's uh, let me grab the phone. Let's pair up. Let's pair up these uh, level U's. Let's take a look at the app real quick and we'll see how it looks. Let's see if I got any juice out of the box. Okay. Got the blinking light. That means we're in pairing mode. So you go to your Samsung level app. Let's click on that. Let's see if we can pair it up just like this. Talk amongst yourselves in the meantime. Okay, no devices found. Let me just let me just check something real quick. Let's see if there's is there a pairing button on this. No pairing button. Matter of fact, what I'll do is. Let's just pair this up Bluetooth first. Let's just go to regular Bluetooth and pair it up the old fashioned way. Okay, these are paired up now. Let's take it back to the level app. Okay, now, all right, so we had to pair it up regular Bluetooth way first. So here's the level U app. Now this will also work with your uh, level over headphones if you got those two. You got a user's manual. Let's see. You got your connection man, uh, connection ma <laughs> your connection manager. <laughs> got tongue tied for a minute there. You got manage notifications. Now, what that means is, if you're wearing these at work and you just got them around your neck and you got one side in or maybe both sides in, you can have certain. Let's turn it on. You can have certain notifications being read out loud. Let's see which ones come stock. Okay, so basically anything that that uh, that you check will will be announced, and it got everything on here. So I wouldn't check all of them because if you're wearing them, you're going to be getting a lot of messages all day. But just the important ones. So if you work somewhere at a job and you don't want to be that douchebag on your phone every five minutes at work, 
You just turn on turn on the notifications. This way you can get your text messages read out loud, get your missed phone calls, get all your Tinder alerts, whatever you're doing. All right. So you can manage your favorite apps. You got shortcuts right here. We'll do all that later. We'll do that stuff later. Let's see. Let's go to settings real quick. Use voice commands. We'll turn those on. And you got music auto off and on. I will right, we'll leave it off. I hate when you plug in as soon as you connect to Bluetooth headphones and music just pops right up. And you got a bout. So that's pretty much it. And you can also change the volume from right here on the device. So that's kind of cool too. So if you're wearing them in your ear, you don't have to be fig uh, fidgeting around for these little, little buttons on the side. You could use the device. And you could just have notifications on and off from one button. Oh, and another good thing about the app, I almost forgot. You can see the actual battery life of the headset. So no more guessing. So once you got your app connected, you don't have to worry about how much battery you got left. It'll show you right there. So now, with all that being said, the most important part is, let me put these on and uh, let's do a quick sound test. Okay. Ah, oh boy. Now, since y'all ain't gonna re really be able to hear the music, I'm just gonna go to my, let's go to Amazon Music Player. Let's um, throw on a song real quick. I'll throw some Fetty Wap on real quick. Let me turn these on maximum volume. Let's see, uh, okay, I'm about to test it right now. Okay, when you, when you get maximum volume, you hear a little beep. Baby, won't you come my way? Okay, a lot of bass. A lot of bass. All right. All right. <laughs> Shout out to the singing voice, all right? That was for the ladies. Now, real talk, though. A lot of bass. Let me take these off. I'm talking extra loud. These sound great. They sound great. They right on par with the gear circles. All right, the gear circles and these pretty much sound the same. They pretty much sound the same. I love the sound in the gear circles. These sound great. A lot of bass, nice and crystal clear. But now we got to test. Let's make a phone call and then let's test the noise cancellation. And I got a way to do that. All right, so let me, let's call somebody real quick. Let's see, who can we call? Let's call one of these 24-hour diners and find out what time they close. All right, so I call up, um... I call up Georgia Peach, the Georgia Peach Diner. Okay, so far the ring sounds clear. I got both ears in. Yeah, hi, um, I wanted to find out what time you guys close tonight. Oh, you never close? Okay, good. <laughs> All right, thanks. Okay, now. Sounded crystal clear. Sounded crystal clear, nice and loud. This dude said we never close. <laughs> Not 24 hours, we never close. All right. Now, I was going to mess with him a little bit, but I let that go. I let that go. All right, so they sounded nice. Now, let's test the noise cancellation feature. And the best way to do that is let's act like if we uh, <laughs> if we inside of a club or something, inside of a party, and we got to make a phone call. So I still got this Iowa system connected. Let me put the headphones back in. All right, I got the Iowa system connected. Let's play some music, and I'll call another diner. All right, hold on a second. Let me pair, let me pair this up real quick. I got a message, too, just now. And it said inbox. So I got a Google inbox. So it read the message just now. That's, that's nice. All right, let's play some music. Wait a second. I got to connect. Probably got too much stuff connected at the same time. Oh, my bad. Talk amongst yourself for a second, fellas. I'm just pairing up this uh, Iowa joint. Okay. Now, let me see. Let's let's go back to the sound cloud. You know what? My bad, fellas. I had to go grab my Nexus. I think my Nexus is already connected 
to this Iowa. Let me double check. I know. I'm killing y'all. I know. <laughs> I would usually I would usually pause the video and come back, but y'all know this is live videos, no edit in the lab. Let's see. Let's see if the eye was already connected. Oh boy. Any day now. Just pulling up the song. Try not to get copy copy written up in here. Alright, let me let me let me pair up this real quick. My bad fellas, I know. <laughs> Let's see, connecting to the Iowa. Okay, I I was busting my balls right now, giving me a little headache. Let's turn it off and turn it back on. I just I, I just had it paired up right before this video, y'all. Trust me. Okay, I just heard something. Okay, here we go. Now, now it connected back to the G4. Right after I just turned the G4 off. <laughs> oh boy. Ah, oh, any day now. Let's see. Let's try to connect it again now to the to this one. Okay, here we go. All right, so now let's make a phone call. I'm talking mad loud. Let's make a phone call and see if they can hear us. I'm going to call USA Diner this time. All right, so we'll call USA Diner. See if we can cancel some noise. Yeah, hi, um, I wanted to find out what time you guys close. Oh, you guys are 24 hours? All right, now, do y'all do takeout? Um, can I come in and place an order to takeout? All right, cool. Where you located at? Okay, can you can you hear me okay? Is the music too loud? Can you hear me okay? Oh, okay, good. All right, so I'll be there in a few minutes. All right, thanks. All right. <laughs> that was a hot mess, but it worked. Now, and I, I will say this. I will say this. I don't know about as much noise cancellation. Like, you know, is this some big fancy noise cancellation? No. But when you put these... When you put the earbuds in, if you notice when I had them in both at the same time, I ended up talking a little bit louder. So you do got you do kind of have that feel of noise cancellation. Now, when I was talking to the dude on the phone just now, he heard me perfectly fine. I heard him perfectly fine. And I had the music blasting. And I, normally you wouldn't be sitting right that close to some music trying to make a phone call. But y'all get the idea. So now, look, I'm, I don't know if it's official noise echo, echo cancellation and all that high-tech terminology. The point is, I had the music on right in front of my face with that big, giant Iowa system, and I was able to hear him. So, and he was able to hear me, so they, sound, they sounded perfectly fine. And if you wear them both at the same time, just like any other, any other blue, Bluetooth headphones when you make phone calls, it sounds weird when you're talking to somebody with both, both, <laughs> both ear, ear pieces in at the same time. It sounds like you hear their voice right in your brain. I, and I like these. I like these. So for 66 bucks, these all win. Now, the main difference is you're not going to have to worry about this, this um, stupid plastic neck piece. You're not going to have to worry about that. You're not going to have to be you know, being all gentle and careful every time you take these on and off. Look at look at the level of flexion on these. So even if you're a big giant, you know, gorilla type dude, and your neck is like this, these will still be able to fit you. But for the regular person, just like in my neck is big, I put these on and they fit comfortably. So I, I ain't gonna see no problem rocking these all day. So on the scale of one to ten, I'm giving these a certified win. You see, when 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 they go around your neck, let's let's put them like this. These are gonna lay flat. Okay, they're gonna lay flat. And this time you notice the difference. They got the earbuds facing outwards. See now on the on the on the gear circle, you could you could wear these backwards if you want and have them like this. But either way, either way you wear them, it's just they, they just stick out too much. They stick out too much. Now, look, let me let me try something. 
Let me put them on reverse real quick. Because I really don't wear... Yeah, I don't really wear these ones like this reverse. I wear them the other way. You know, I kind of wear them the other way so you can see that. When you wear them like this, this just looks nicer than wear them like, wear them like this. You know, there, there's, some, there's some downsides to wearing them like this. You know, if these get dirty or they start looking funky, you're not going to want to have that on display. You're going to want to wear them like this. Where you, or you got this nice, you know, shiny piece on the front. Same thing with these. Same thing with these. Has a nice little shiny piece on the front. If you want to wear them up, you know, backwards, your choice. But you wear them like this. This lays a little bit. Mm, they still gonna, they're not going to stick out as much because look at the difference. You see the difference in the bottoms? These are a little bit more flat. All right, but still, it don't matter. We're not going to get too technical. These are only 65 bucks. 60, what, 66? So you're looking at 70 bucks. In when I went into Best Buy, they were selling these for $70 plus tax. So if you buy them from Amazon, 66 bucks, you're going to get, you know, 100%, $70 with the free delivery. So that's a win right here. On a scale of 1 to 10, I'm giving these a win. They sounded great. These are going to be my new everyday headphones every day other than um, when I'm not rocking these. Now, these are still tried and true. These are still classics right here, the LG Tones. These are still classic, but these are just a little bit bigger and got a little bit more weight to these. When you're wearing these, you know you're wearing them. Maybe after about three, four hours, then you might forget. But when you first put these on and for the first maybe hour or two, you're going to know these are around your neck. These are a little bit more low profile. All right, so 70 bucks for these. Let me know what y'all think. Shout out to everybody that rock with me on Facebook, Foursquare, Twitter, Google+. Plus. Shout out to all the Google gangsters I see you holding down that Facebook page. Shout out to everybody hitting me up on Voxer. And a special shout out to everybody rocking with me on Instagram. Y'all know that's where I'm at full time, 100% full throttle. And a special shout out to everybody rocking with the Amazon Warrior on Sundays. Y'all already know, stream gangsters on deck. Get your drinks ready. No meat boys allowed. Oh yeah, one more thing. I almost forgot. Fellas, ladies, say it with me. All y'all haters, all y'all trolls, close your eyes. And pitching me rolling. It's your boy Floss, I'm out. Deuces. Oh yeah. Two more things I almost forgot. Shout out to the Scissor Squad. Shout out to the Donut Boys. Always in the building. Deuces.